Hello, everyone. Welcome to GoLeopards.com. I'm Gary Laubach. I am with Kia Damon Olson, the sixth year head coach for Lafayette College. Six years in, that means five years under your belt. How is year six different from year one for you? Well, I mean, as you're alluding to, it's the level of knowing, right? Mm -hmm. It's the level of knowing myself as a head coach and um, being able to take something from a vision in your head and actually build it on on the floor and then go through different iterations of what the, uh, the specific team is able to do within that vision. So just more comfortable in some of those things. Well, that certainly, I'm sure, is the case. You look very comfortable always on the sidelines. Uh, let's make note, two of your assistants. They have stuck with you. They're all back mm -hmm. from the last couple of years for sure. Uh, you have to like that, and that's kind of a sign that they obviously like the way you do things. Yeah, I have a great staff. Um, I've been very fortunate. You know, Tom's been here with me since, you know, we arrived at, at Lafayette. Mm -hmm. Katie's going into year four. This is just under second year. Um, I think, you know, when you look at the combination of us, we bring different things to the table as our strengths. And I think that bodes well for our group. Let's talk strengths and weaknesses of this basketball team. First of all, the roster is slim. Yep. There's only 11 players yep. on the roster, good or bad. As long as everybody's healthy, you can scrimmage for sure. Uh, so what are the strengths of this basketball team and what are some of the things that really you really have to work on and work on hard? You know, I think our versatility is our strength. If you'll think back when I first had the press conference, that's one of the things that we talked mm -hmm. about, really getting to the position of playing positionless basketball. And I think we have really 11 players. Most of them can at least play two positions. Some of them can play really anywhere that we would need them to play to be successful. So I think our speed is picked up. That's mm -hmm. one thing about being a little bit shorter in the post. We're a lot faster, more mobile. Um, so that will allow us to do more pressing, and that's something we've had a vision to do um, from the very first year as well. And now having the personnel that allows us to do that will definitely help our defense get better, mm -hmm. thus hopefully helping our offense generate more points. You certainly have an emotional leader. You only have one senior, mm -hmm. but she is a go and get them kind of senior, Jess Booth. Yep. So I'm sure she has been kind of the the young lady that the rest of the team has kind of centered around is almost like the team mama. You know, Jess has always had a um, level of wisdom beyond her years mm -hmm. um, that she would exhibit even as a freshman. And now she's grown four years here and has a better understanding of what her leadership looks like, what impacts success for the group, what doesn't. And I think she really has bought into being the lone senior um, and being able to teach while she's on the sidelines resting as well as demonstrate when we're in practice. Mm -hmm. I can't uh, let you go without talking a little bit about Abby because she kind of turned uh, turned the season on last year anytime she had the basketball. Is she just as creative? Is she just as energetic? Uh, is she doing some things better than she was able to do last year? Well, she's doing all things better mm -hmm. this year, you know, with a year under your belt, stronger, um, have a better understanding of what college basketball is, have a better understanding of what we're doing. And you're starting to see all of that come to fruition. Abby's a kid that has really played a lot off of her instincts and feel. And now, and I, I should say not necessarily now this year, but last year started mm -hmm. to teach her a little bit more of what it truly means to run a team and what should that feel like and what should that sound like from you. When Jess does it, it looks a certain way, but mm -hmm, the way you're mm -hmm. going to do it is going to have a different feel to it. And so just getting her comfortable in those spaces. Our film sessions are much different this year than uh, last year, even from practice and scrimmages. So I think she's poised to just continue her trajectory of her development, and both Jess and Abby will have a significant impact on our team. Speaking of comfort and speaking of pro uh, pro projecting and going ahead, how about the three freshmen? How are they fitting in? You know what? They're doing really, really well. Um, their energy, their work ethic, all of that is translating um, into our group. One of the things that was an Achilles heel last year was the consistency of perimeter shooting. All of the new kids really help us in that capacity. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So we're going to shoot the ball better. You know, we've had scrimmages where we've taken 23s. We've shot 52%. Those aren't things that we've done in the past. Mm -hmm. So those kind of things are exciting. But they're also freshmen, right? So you know they're going to be ups and downs, peaks and valleys. And so it's just giving them opportunities to grow with the group and to contribute where they can be successful. Tough independent schedule, as always. You open at VCU in uh, just about a little less than a week. Uh, we're looking forward to it. I'm sure you're excited. No, I'm really excited to get the season started. You know, we've been practicing what feels like six weeks already. Mm -hmm. And so just to be able to go against other teams and to scheme, you know, multiple times a week for different things that we're going to see, that part starts to be the fun part. 
um, as well as we're going to be a work in progress. You know, like I tell the kids, we're inexperienced in the sense that we don't have a ton of players who have a wealth of game minutes. But that doesn't mean that that has to be something that hurts us. We can mm -hmm. use that mm -hmm. to our advantage. And a lot of the season, non-conference in particular, we'll be figuring that out. I'm excited about it. It'll all come to fruition very shortly. We'll be there along the way. Kia, thank you so oh, much. No problem. Go Leopards.